All right, so now what I just did is I just drill a hole and then this is gonna be for the junction box. So, put a two screws on this side. And then another one on this side. So the wire will be coming from behind. Okay, so there we go. That's there. Now I just put the wire here. Go to the front, all the way. Okay, here. And then, do this. Put the bracket. So the bracket's gonna go <clears throat> somewhat like this, like that. Need two screws. There's a big one, two bad one. It's gonna be dark really soon. Really, really soon. Ah, uh, this wired, I'm not even, I'm using solar uh, to power this light. So that's another subject uh, that I wanna talk about. But just when you're dealing with electrical, make sure you turn off all of the circuit breakers, okay? Make sure that the wire, they're not live, okay? because you don't want to get electrocuted. Just use this to hang this over here while you're connecting the wires together. Uh, I'm just gonna use, it's really simple. Uh, I'm gonna cut this a little bit longer. For the ground. <clears throat> the, the copper cable, a wire, uh, that's usually ground or 100% or ground, okay? So you connect that into inside the junction box. Strip a little more down. So longer, easy to work with. Maybe it's too long, then you can pull it back. And then you can put, uh, and just put it over here. Okay. And you just tighten it for the lines tight, you're good. And then for this one right here, cable wise is really easy. Uh, white, go to white. Black, go to black. From the light fixtures, it only has two wires white and black. Just connect the wires according to the color. White to white. 
give it a good twist. Make sure you go a couple turns. Okay. You do the same thing with the black. I don't know if you can see it. Pretty straightforward. Uh, Give it a good twist. Here we go. All right, so once in, just push this inside. Just make sure it, there's no copper wire or any bare wire that's touching, okay? Just make sure it doesn't block this hole that right there. Here. Turn it around. Make sure this goes into like this. You need a long screw. I just need a long screwdriver. Okay, let me see if this one will work. <coughs> Can I hold it real quick? I need to lower this the other way. Okay. Oh, this is. I need a long one. This is not not it. All right, so just make sure you put the wire in and there. Line it up. It's in. Make sure to tighten it all the way. Okay. <clears throat> okay. It's all the way in. All right. You gone? Yeah, you can get out. All right. So all the wiring is done. So for the. So for the junction box. Uh, we're not going to use the outside hole, so we're, we're going to cover it up. That way, water doesn't get in. There's like four of them. Oh, let me put one on this, this side so you can see it. I should have done it when I was on the on the ground. It should be a lot easier. But it should be the same. I need a flat one. This one is... Okay. And you do that to all four. So they have your four, two on top, and then two on bottom. So pretty. Do you like it, Aiden? Don't touch it. Don't touch it, Aiden. Don't touch Don't get near there. I on my electrical panel. I don't want to touch it, boy. Yeah, baby. There's one up here.
chút xíu nữa mình chỉnh là cái camera So the light we can pretty much like later in a little bit we can fix it to however we like it This part here towards the end, like right now in the back, and my sauna. What I'm doing right now is pretty much just gonna run uh, the wire management all the way back to the uh, solar panel over there. Go next one. Okay, so the, as, as I was telling you guys earlier, uh, I'm using my solar uh, energy to power my uh, my wife's uh, flood tent. So if you look at over here, I just finished with the installation and the wire is coming down and it's coming through in here. Okay, and inside here, uh, I have the inverter, uh, 2000 watts, and I got two 100 amps. Uh, batteries i got a uh, solar charger and i got the switch here and i got a hundred watts uh solar panel i think this is going to be more than enough to power the the uh, floodlight okay so right now it's finished so this is going to be uh waterproof so rain it doesn't matter it doesn't uh, you know rain cannot get into here okay and there's a lot of ventilation for the battery as well so right now i'm going to use my ipad and we're going to take a look check out the 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 cam itself and let's see if it's going to start see as right now you can see that it's already detecting uh me in the camera so it sent me like a notifications already so now we're going to check out the uh the siren so i don't know how loud that is it's it's not that loud but you know for like intruders or something someone who's with the bad intention trying to steal your 
package here, stuff like that, you know, that's gonna scare them away, okay? And you can do this through the app, okay? I haven't had a chance to actually go through all the setting with the camera itself. So that's pretty much uh, what we just did. The installations, the, the junction box, the wiring, uh, and everything is pretty much it. I'm just gonna wrap up, put all my tools away, and um, call it a night. Uh, maybe in the next video or something, or maybe in the future video, I'll talk more about the settings or uh, stuff like that for the cameras. But for now, it's up and running along with my other uh, wise cams. You guys know I'm a big fan of wise cams. It's uh, cheap, uh, affordable, reliable, great uh, qualities of the, the, the video. So I have a lot of wise cameras installed around my house. As you can see, I got the long driveway uh, and I got the uh, another one uh, by my garage. And then I got one like as, as before they approach my front door. And this one is after they approach my front door, then I can see all of them. Okay. And this, I got like, uh, this is the, this cam right here. It's a pan cam. So I can spin it around and then check out what people. All right. So here, my backyard, uh, and this is my living room, my office and my kitchen. And last but not least, this is the uh, flood cam that I just installed. Okay. And now this is facing the other way. So at any angles, you know, uh, you can see that, you know, I get all notification around my house. So, uh, by the way, this, uh, this video is not sponsored by wise, uh, just because I love the product and, uh, I like, uh, you know, uh, to, you know, just to share my own experience with wise. Okay. So wise, if you're out there, you want me to review your product, you know, let me know. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.